Hey guys, welcome to BTEC. Gina here with a look at the Google Pixel phones. Okay, so we don't actually know yet what they look like or what will be inside them, but there have been some pretty comprehensive rumors rolling around the web, so I will take a look at those. First, what we do know is that they will be dropping on October the 4th. That's next week. We do not have long to wait at all. And what we also are pretty sure of is that they're going to be called the Pixel and the Pixel XL. Google is officially dropping that Nexus name and bringing in in the Pixel phones with Android Nougat so we know that much but let's take a look at what we don't know but what we think we probably know starting with the design so the Pixel should come in at 5 inch of screen and the Pixel XL we're expecting 5.5 inch they're going to be potentially manufactured by HTC that's what all the rumors are leaning towards so maybe something that looks along the lines of the HTC 10 and we're also expecting colors of black silver and blue blue seems to be all the rage right now with smartphones. We have seen leaked photos of the silver slash white version and they sort of look a bit boring to me. I'm kind of hoping that these are false rumors and we can expect something much more exciting but you can see there's a fingerprint scanner around the back and no physical home button around the front just very slim bezels which is good to see. There's also that USB type C charging port down the bottom. I can't quite see if it has a headphone jack or not Fingers crossed it does, I still have a heap of headphones lying around at home. We're expecting both the phones to have the same cameras, which would be 12 megapixel rear cameras and 8 megapixel front cameras. As for what's powering these phones, well, they're 2016 flagships, so they're designed to take on the best of the best. Google wants to beat Apple's iPhone 7, they want to beat the Samsung Galaxy S7, they want to beat the LG G5 and the HTC 10, so we can expect to see a Qualcomm Snapdragon 821 or 823 under the hood and 4 gigabytes of RAM, that's what we're hearing. As for battery power, well, you can expect the Pixel to have a slightly smaller battery than the Pixel XL, so around 2,700 for the Pixel and going into the 3500 area for the Pixel XL which is fantastic both of them should be able to get you through a full day. As for pricing we don't have any word on that yet but these are 2016 flagships and they will be running Android Nougat so you can probably expect to be paying top dollar and that's probably as well why Google's moving away from the Nexus name and rebranding to the Pixel name so that they can charge a little bit more. So what do you guys think? Do these sound like the phones for you? I personally love a stock Android experience so I cannot wait to get my hands on it remember October the 4th thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed this roundup if you did make sure you hit that thumbs up button don't forget to subscribe so you guys can see the phones as soon as we do